What's up everyone, Takedown here, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be sharing a list of games that fans want to see on the PlayStation 5. Let's get right into this. So with the PlayStation 5 announced for the holidays this year, everybody is wondering what games we're going to see on the PlayStation 5, and that makes fans very curious. So today I'm going to be sharing a short list of games that I think could potentially be on the PlayStation 5, and some that have been teased to be doing so. Up first is Grand Theft Auto 6. Now this is on everybody's top list of what they expect to see on the PlayStation 5, and even Rockstar announced that if they do make Grand Theft Auto 6, it's not going to be on the PlayStation 4, making everybody wonder and expect to see it on the PlayStation 5 anyways. However, Grand Theft Auto 5 had so much success on the PlayStation 4 for many, many years, especially with GTA Online being so successful. I definitely feel like there's going to be another Grand Theft Auto in the future. In my opinion, if there is going to be a Grand Theft Auto 6, I definitely expect to see it on the PlayStation 5. And I expect that they're going to combine a lot of the previous games. So I'm expecting to see all of Los Santos, Vice City, and Liberty City in that game for Grand Theft Auto 6. I think they're going to basically combine the map because a lot of fan-made stuff online where there is a combined map of all the former Grand Theft Auto games into one huge map. I think that's something that Rockstar could pull off and I would love to see that for Grand Theft Auto 6. Next up is Fallout 5 but not online like Fallout 76 was basically kind of like Fallout 4 was but I would like to see co-op on just a regular Fallout game. So instead of how 76 was more online and there's not too many quests and it's not really a character building experience, it's more of an online game within the Fallout universe, I just want to see something that basically takes how Fallout used to be with Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas, Fallout 4, and basically have a co-op aspect so you can play with a friend within your save files i think that'd be pretty awesome to see and i'm a huge fan of fallout so i love apocalyptic games anyway so i really expect there to be a fallout game on the playstation 5 next up is call of duty ghosts 2 i know not everybody loved call of duty ghosts but i did mainly because for call of duty i was never really a fan of the zombie mode but in call of duty ghosts there was the alien invasion mode which i was a huge fan of I played that so much for me. That was a hugely successful mode. It was a lot of fun to play with friends. You could have up to four people playing, kind of like you can with zombies. But it was, for me anyways, a much more of a fun experience. Multiplayer was also very much fun for Call of Duty Ghosts because the maps were destructible. So a nuke could drop and change the map. Or you could shoot a gas station and have it explode and cause damage to the map itself so there was a lot to do in call of duty ghosts so i expect and i honestly would love to see call of duty ghosts 2. next up would be an x-men or guardians of the galaxy game we've seen the huge success on the playstation 4 with the spider-man game that came out that was the second most sold playstation 4 video game of all time so with that being so popular and with marvel being a hugely popular franchise right now especially with Iron Man VR coming out and the Avengers game that came out in early 2020 having a PlayStation 5 game that falls on X-Men or Guardians of the Galaxy would be something epic mainly I decided on those two out of everything for Marvel I decided on X-Men and Guardians of the Galaxy because there's quite a few characters in each of those franchises so I think they could make a pretty epic game and something that I honestly would love to play Next up is Payday 3, which is up in the air right now because I don't think that the creators are uh, going to be existing for much longer because Payday 2 is the last game I think they put out. I think the last that I read was they're working on Payday 3. However, they shut the doors on every other project except Payday 3, and they're basically putting all their money towards Payday 3 if they cannot get it out in time or if it's not successful. They basically have to shut their doors so if payday 3 does come out right now i believe it's in progress i would like to see it on the playstation 5 because i love heist style games 
Next up is Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 Remastered. We've seen Call of Duty Remastered games before, and Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 is one of my favorite games. Not only was the gameplay and the story fantastic, but the multiplayer was awesome. I could actually snipe in it, which is something that I can't do in current Call of Duty games. And that's the reason why I don't enjoy Call of Duty anymore. But the online maps were amazing, story mode was amazing, and there was no zombies. Because as you guys know, I never liked zombies in Call of Duty. Next up would be a new Midnight Club game. I know Rockstar stopped making the Midnight Club games, but I'm a huge fan of racing games. And honestly, comparing them to Need for Speed, Midnight Club was my favorite out of all racing games. The reason I say that is because their customization options were so much better. There was so much more you could do rather than what you can do in Need for Speed. In Need for Speed, you can still customize games, but in Midnight Club, you could have an original, something that nobody else could have created for your vehicles. For something like bumpers, front bumpers, there was, let's say, 20 different options for each vehicle. Whereas for Need for Speed, you might have four to six, so... Not too much you could do in Need for Speed, whereas in Midnight Club you could do a lot. I would like to see another Midnight Club video game. Next up is Grand Theft Auto San Andreas Remastered. I know this is something that will be hard to do and something I don't see them actually doing, but as a fan of Grand Theft Auto, I think that'd be interesting if they were to pull it off. Because as you guys see with the days of video games now, a lot of video games for different franchises from the past are getting remastered for current consoles. So I would like to see Grand Theft Auto San Andreas come back. I did manage to play it on the PlayStation 4, but it was mainly the PlayStation 2 version, just with trophies on the PlayStation 4, and was able to beat the game and platinum it. So if they were to remaster it with better graphics and maybe better gameplay, and just mechanics of the game in general, I think a lot of fans would really enjoy to play it once again. Next up would be Far Cry 6. I'm a huge fan of the Far Cry franchise, ever since Far Cry 5 and Far Cry New Dawn. I did want to go back and play some of the older games, Far Cry 4 and Primal. I just never got around to it, and I just would rather see a new game come out and play a new game rather than go back to play some of the old ones, but I do plan on playing them in the future. And the last one is an open-world zombie game. I did read that there's supposed to be an overkill Walking Dead game, but every time they announce a release date, it keeps getting pushed back and pushed back, and it's something that might come out, might not come out. But basically, if I've seen an open world zombie game, I would like to see there be co-op, not really online, but more of co-op where you can have friends join you, and it be a realistic survival game where you have to get food, supplies, ammo, weapons, shelter. You can come across enemies and you could either attack them and steal what they have or try to combine them with your people and build more like have more people in your group but with more people means you have to get more supplies so it's basically a decision maker whether whether you want to take on the apocalypse as a good person and try to help others or as a bad person and try to just survive on your own or with your people and to take from others with the days of uh, open world games on console being so in depth of what you can do, I think an actual open world zombie game with co-op where you can play with your friends would be epic. I'm not talking about something like Fallout 5 where there's mutants and different things around the world, uh, like around your, around the map basically. But to have an open world zombie game, something like The Walking Dead, where your goal is to survive and your biggest threat is survival and zombies, not necessarily radiation and mutants like Fallout does. So I would like to see an open world zombie game. But these are the list of the games that I would like to see on the PlayStation 5, and a lot of fans are expecting to see some of these come true on the PlayStation 5. Comment down below what you would like to see happen on the PlayStation 5 and what games you think are going to be out on that console whenever it does drop this holiday season. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like because it does help me out and know what kind of content you guys are interested in. And I'm going to leave this video here. Please take care. Peace.